Hello traders, this is Fawad Razak Zalan, Market Analyst for City Index. Today is the 13th of September 2023. So we just had the inflation data from the US, which came in stronger than expected. But despite that, as you can see on this chart of the cable, the dollar has actually weakened um, since the data was released. That being said, the part of least resistance for the cable continues to remain to the downside because the inflation data should encourage the Fed to keep interest rates uh, high for longer in the US and with oil prices rising, this may well encourage them to hike one more time before the year is out. Meanwhile, the Bank of England is expected to hold interest rates um, with uh, economic data from the UK coming in weaker than expected as we saw this morning with GDP. And in Europe as well, uh, the latest economic indicators all point to a recession there. So the likes of the pound against the dollar and the euro against the dollar should remain uh, in a bearish trend as they have been in the last few weeks. So with the cable, uh, price is currently testing 125 resistance le level. This uh, shaded region was previously support um, before price broke below it. So the cable could well turn lower again from here. Um, and if it does, then the sellers may target liquidity below the 200 day moving average which held today and um, below that the next downside target will be the may low at 123.08 the euro has also bounced back and it is now testing this shaded area which was previously support now it could turn into resistance at around 107.65 to 107.75 ish if resistance holds here and we turn lower then the next downside target will be 107 the recent low below that there's nothing significant until the may 2023 low at 106.35 for more analysis make sure to check out the news and analysis section at cityindex.com happy trading